Ah, yes, Mrs. Donovan. I'm on my way out the door this minute to show you the property. See you there. Bye-bye. Good night, Barbara. Good night. Hello? Um, I mean, Morgan Realty. Yes, he did. And yes, I am. Gina, are you sure this guy isn't going to pull anything? Charlie? Charlie's a pussycat. Excuse me, Barbara. Just a second, Gina. Hi, Jerry. Barbara, could you stay for about five minutes? I have a very important letter I need to get out. Sure, sure. Gina, I gotta go. I gotta type up a letter. Gina, are you sure this guy won't try anything? Barbara, Charlie's afraid of girls. <laughs> you couldn't be safer in a church. Okay. I'm just going out with him because I trust you. What? Jerry, what are you doing? What's going on over there? Is Jerry raping you? Cut that out, you son of a bitch! Oh. Stop. I don't want this and I don't need it. Wait a minute, Barbara. What's he doing? Does he have his cock out? I want my money. I quit. Jerry, I would never have thought this of you. After all the years we've known each other, too. Oh, Christ, Barbara. I don't, I don't know what came over me. I've always had this thing for you. Even when I was married, I'd look at her, I'd look at you. Please don't quit. Think it over. Come in tomorrow. Promise me you'll think it over. If you promise you won't do that again. But you're going to get a cut and pay because you won't call me. Barbara, will you answer the phone, please? Oh, it's you, Gina. I can't talk right now. I'm too upset. I'll call you later. Charlie was an ass, and the party was terrible. Our whole life is, fu is falling apart. I'll talk to you later. What's the matter, honey? What's wrong? Nothing can be as bad as all that. Why don't you take the day off? But I've got so much work to do. To hell with it. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll take the day off, too. We'll go to the beach for lunch. Maybe we'll drive down the coast highway a little later. Come on, I'm the boss, you know. Full zero there.
Thanks for today, Jerry. It really helped a lot. You know me, good guy, Morgan. Let's go in. It's been years since I've seen Paul. I'd like to see him again. No, Jerry, not tonight. Listen, you're a very sweet guy, and I had a wonderful time today. But I tell you what, come over for supper tomorrow night, okay? Right now, I've got to go. Oh, well. Good guys always get laid last. Hey, sweetheart, when do we eat? In a few minutes. No, no, Paul might see us. Listen, you two. Be sure and keep next weekend open. We're going to do a little traveling. Traveling? Yes, didn't I tell you? I own a uh, little cabin at Lake Tahoe. No, Jerry, you didn't. It must be lovely at this time of year. Well, we'll go up. We'll get a little sun. We'll do a little gambling. How does that sound? It sounds lovely. I can't make it. I'm going to be busy. I'll see you later. What do you... What's the matter? You've hardly eaten anything. You seem to have lost my appetite. Maybe you had a date. Oh, you know how teenagers are. Oh, we're alone at last. All this eating is making me I don't know this, Barbara. But I've always been in love with you. I think I sort of did know Jerry.